Ah, oh, Mr. Douglas, you've resurfaced. Good. Miss Shah was about to call for a locum. You have your gastric problems? I, uh... And here's hoping that you have considering the day ahead of you. A light aircraft came down on descent to Bristol Airport. We have four adults with severe trauma injuries, so most of us will be running between theatres. You'll have to captain the ship here, please. See you on the ice. Sarah. Must have been a vicious bug. I was going to call No, you. no, no, I get it. It's none of my business. You want me off your back. Well, if that's what you want, that's what you'll get. Anyway, Miss Wiseman needs to be prepped. Just waiting on two referrals from the ED. You're looking for someone. He's still here, but not for long. He's been discharged today. That is, if you can manage it. Just waiting on his mates. Morning. Um, have you two met? This is, uh... Oh, just been transferred from Pete's. Clakey. Oh, you can just call her Nurse Jones. So you want me to discharge her? What, you think I engineered this plane crash just to push the two of you back into each other's arms? Mm -hmm. Anyway, rejoice. The pack of lies you told him obviously did the trick. He hasn't asked for you again. All right, I get it. Now cut it out. Excellent. All yours. No. You can go in, you know. No, I'm um, already late. How is she? She's getting there. Definitely. More to the point, how are you? Oh, um, fine. Fine, I'm good. There's still a long way to go, and she is very frail. And it's not just the physical issues that we're going to have to keep on top of. She's going to need a lot of support. But there's no reason why we can't do that on Keller. Oh, that's great. When do you think... To today. Today? That is good news, isn't it? Sure. It's great. Say goodbye. Your mother said what? She said if I don't go back to work ASAP, it will be me in the coffin next. <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh, it's so good to have you back. So, how are you doing? Life is a bitch and then you die. End of. Oh, um, she gave you these as a thank you present. Oh, wow. For getting in there on time for my dad's funeral. Ukrainian chocolates. These come with a health warning. Wait! just about to have you paged. We're going into Keller Theatre together. Oh, and uh, Chrissy wanted me to talk through the weekend with you, yeah? Yeah, of course. No sweat. Oh, uh, Dan, do you fancy a chocolate? Hello. Yeah, I'm still here. And I'm still waiting, so any time today, any time at all will be really appreciated. Sorry. Yeah, you sound it. Got my text? Double shot? What a star. What? Oh, hello there. I text my order in. Do you know? Taught myself an AAU with that one of these. Grim. She's an AU? Oh, yeah. Yeah, she's the new F1. Oh, joy to the world. Suddenly miss Ukraine. You must be Frida. The nurse will go through this, but uh, you need to make an appointment with your GP to check in the scar in at least three days. Oh. And you need to take one of these at least four times a day. And the diazepam. 
And make sure you keep on top of it. Take them regularly. Sure. Thanks. All right, then. They don't know jack about you. Do they? The people you work with. Not much to know. Is that what you like? About what happened? No, he might be dead, but what he did to us, it's never going to go away. Never. Nothing happened to me. Look after yourself. I mean it. Cal. I'm away today. You have to tell me. Oh, I have to know. There's nothing to tell. Nothing? Nothing. A hundred and eighty calories? Isn't this meant to be low fat? I can that's right. I've no idea. I've got this brilliant app on my phone. It counts your calories for you. And it's a pedometer, so it counts your steps for you, too. And then it takes your steps away from your calories. Brilliant. I, I don't really know much about... I'm in AAU today, so I thought, oh, I'll get myself a little treat. Well, more of a snack, really. Don't get a chance for a loo break in there. Oh, I get that one. I love lavender. The other one's a bit lingering. Are you treating yourself? Good for you. Actually, it's for my mum. Oh, of course. How is she? I knew she'd pull through. Mr Griffin's so brilliant, isn't he? Yes, sir. Excuse me. You should see the council, you know. Take him to the cleaners. Sorry? The same thing happened to my van. The boiler blew up because it hadn't been serviced. I bet it was something like that, wasn't it? I knew it. It's criminal what they get away with. Yeah, sorry, I've, I've got a lot to be getting on with. I'll run counter. Excuse me. Hmm? Sorry. Some serious psyching up action going on over there. Uh-huh. Yesterday she was banging on about having his mobile phone number. He gave it to her apparently so she could call any time. Yeah, her and half of females in Holby. Well, look who is back. I missed you. Never thought I'd say that before. And look, uh, I'm sorry to get a chance to catch I'm you. I'm fine. I'm a daft cookie. Who's got Mrs. Batterji? Me. Oh, she says she's been waiting ages for her scan results. And that would be because... Let's see, um... No? They're not here yet. Okay, Dr. Petrenko, this is Dr. Hutchison. We've met. Have we? I like the hair. It's uh, very... Right. Uh, Mr. Spence, about the students' tour. Say what? Yeah, I forgot to remind you about the students. Oh, well, that's not gonna happen. This airplane crash means that this is literally a flying visit, no pun intended. I'm stuck in theater all day, so I'm gonna leave it to you guys to sort it out. I'm, I'm here, here, so it's... Ladies, take it easy. I'll make you wrestle for it in a second. Go for it. The students are all yours. You don't mind, do you? Of course she doesn't. Underneath that hostile glare lies eternal gratitude. You'll get him, Tiger. <laughs> Remote, so you can change channels there for your fancy. Oh, we might be able to catch the end of Bargain Hunt. I love that show. Ah, oh, look who's here. Oh, you two look so much alike. Here, let me take that. No, oh, it's best to leave it. It's okay, Mum. Of course it is. I know what you never can be too careful. Here we go. There you are. Oopsie Daisy. There's a good girl. I'll be right back. Um, hang on a second. Um, what are you... Don't worry, I'm on top of everything. You said you are on AAU today. I know. Change of plan. Mr Griffin talked to me. I'm her name nurse. It's okay. It's all in here. x 
monitor on arrival, regular chest physio, maintenance on IV fluids and monitor urine output. Don't worry about a thing. She's going to get the presidential treatment. So he's just had a theatre? Yeah, ITU's full. Michelle requested we get him into HDU. She'll come down as soon as there's a break. OK, we need some help here. Uh, check if the next of kin are aware. Right, peeps, we're dealing with a flayed chest. Can we get another further three units? And we need ortho to take a look at these limb injuries. What have you got for me? Right. You need to go for a CT scan and hassle the lab for bloods. Yep, book him in for an echo. Mr. Douglas! He started fitting the lift. Oh, he was fine. He was... Um, get one milligram of lorazepam and an oxygen mask. Keep it 100%. We need to run an echo. Come on, come on! Good girl. I'm not a child, you know. Oh! Watch what you're doing. Let me do that. Well, there we go. 37.8. That's it. Good. I was doing it. You didn't need to. Can I have a word, please? I think it's best if I take over. But I was just getting to know her. But she seems pretty agitated. I'm not saying it's you, but... I was specially asked to do this by Mr Griffin, you know. Specially? What do you mean, specially? What did he say? Oh, nothing. I, I just mean... Well, uh, obviously, it's complicated, and having to look after your own mother... Well, it, it's... Well, I'm the senior nurse here, so it's really up to me. But... And I think I'm making the right call. So if you could continue with the meds round. Dr Hutchison? The students aren't coming till lunchtime. You're not skiving all the way till then. Who's skiving? I had to pick up my dry cleaning. What? You don't expect me to take a tour looking like... Me? I'm not wearing scrubs. Do not forsake me, oh my darling. Oh, no. Poor Trevor. And you know him? Yeah. Oh, oh too many. Tourette's or CD and alcohol addiction. Um, he ends up in homeless shelter sometimes, and uh, they send him here when he can't pee anymore. Do not forsake me, oh my darling. Oh, how could I, Trevor? Ben so, Anderson. what happened? Did you forget to make your follow-up appointment? <sighs> oh my God, someone needs a bath. Oh, so, so sorry. There's no need to be sorry. We need to um, catheterize. Uh -huh. And Dr. Hutchison, we may need some help with that bath. Nice try. No can do. Absolutely. We don't need you. Go. So no further convulsions for 10 minutes. Um, SATs 92%, BP 90 over 70. Um, let's give him 500 mils of jello. What's happening? We don't know yet. Has this ever happened before, a fit? A convulsion like this? Andy. So now you want to talk, huh? Of course you do. So you can shift me out. Quit playing with me. I'm trying to help you. Right, sit yourself. Leeds. Leeds United. Oh, it was scouted, wasn't we? Somewhere in 93. The next big thing. Do you remember? No. Of course you wouldn't. Oh, you would, you? You were long gone by then. Anyway, the fit. No, no. He came with me. Right before the trial. I had a fit. I, I couldn't go on. I, yeah, it was in the dressing room. There was, there was people all around me. Here. Right, OK. OK. I just heard. What happened? This is what we're trying to establish. Excuse me. Can I take a look at that? I got you your face cream. And when you feel better, I feel like I could wash got you this. <coughs> Are you okay? Here. <coughs> <laughs> right, yeah. She's like a fogger on that girl. I know. <laughs> Gonna have to hand out earplugs. <laughs> I wonder if she needs all that gloss. Her lips must get dry. Oh, actually. I've got you some lip balm. 
Okay, get you some magazines.